and I was at a <clears throat> coffee shop checking my, you know, social, you know, because it's part of my job. I'm not very good at it. Instagram's good. I like to take pictures, but tweeting I was never good at. I'm like, what am I supposed to say? And then, like, the more time that goes by, the more pressure there is, and uh, it's whatever. But anyway, I was looking at the Twitter, and uh, some, uh, it was blowing up, which doesn't happen on my Twitter account very often. So I get worried first, you know. <laughs> oh. uh, but it was some scientists, some uh, physicists uh, in Switzerland that have done a parody of Collide, and they work at the Large Hadron Collider at CERN. <laughs> and it was, you know, it was pretty funny, and I'm just kind of, uh, I'm an opportunist, so I thought, you know, I'll, I'll tweet them direct message style, and just say, hey, can I come over for a tour? I'll use my, you know, little grain of fame for that. And uh, they said, yeah, sure, it, but you have to cover our parody of Collide. <laughs> and I, I took that as a challenge. Because I think they were thinking I wasn't going to do it, so I went into the studio and I recorded the whole, the whole thing. And I sent it to them, and they were like, oh shit, now I guess we have to let them come. <laughs> so in February, I got to go over there, and uh, we shot a music video for a couple of days, and it just went up yesterday, so it's pretty, it's pretty funny. I, I, you can just tell I'm having trouble not laughing the whole time. <laughs> so, it's a song that you'll recognize because it sounds a lot like that other Collide song. <laughs> this one's called LHC Collide. And instead of being written from a human perspective, it's written from the perspective of a proton. <laughs> so, here, here, here you go. Of space 
seven times Even the sea quarks cannot hide And out of the mess we 